What's up? It's your boy Carcino, once again in the place to be. And let's talk about it. Um, and here it is. Spotify. They have a lawsuit claiming from Wix, WIX, that claims that they owe $1.6 billion in unpaid royalties for songs that they use illegally. Many people were gearing up for an epic New Year's Eve party when uh, attorneys for Wixen, W-I-X-E-N, music publishing, which includes Missy Elliott, Rick James, and filed a whopping $1.6 billion lawsuit against Spotify for copyright infringement. So the legal complaint, which you can read in full, they have it online, claims Spotify is streaming tens of thousands of tracks by artists, including Tom Pelly, uh, Tom Morello, Prophets of Rage, without any license or compensation. The complaint was filed before January the 1st, ahead of the proposed Music Monetization Act, which allowed many things, which among many things would eliminate the headache of identifying songwriters and collect the collective to award royalties accordingly. Unfortunately, this would not be radioactive or what they call it, retractive, I mean. Um... Sorry, this call is killing me. Uh, retroactive. <clears throat> Failure to fail to file this complaint by year's end would have rendered the $1.6 billion in unpaid royalties in potential limbo. We are very disappointed that these services will retroactively get a free pass for actions that we were previously illegal unless we actually file suit before January 1st, 2018. Wixon President Randall Wixon told The Hollywood Reporter, we are fully prepared to go as a fast forward in the courts as required to protect our clients' rights. Anyone who has been following Spotify's yellow brick road of legal issues over copyright infringement and unpaid royalties in the past won't find this latest move surprising. It is most aggressive move against the company yet, though. Spotify blatantly disregards the United States copyright law and has committed willfully ongoing copyright infringement, states the complaint. Probably the most surprising piece of information comes out of the complaint is that the allegation that 21% of the 30 million songs were on Spotify are unlicensed. The basis of this complaint is that Spotify has implicitly failed to obtain mechanical licenses for the uses of the work. In other words, songwriters aren't being paid, while labels are getting paid, and roughly $500 million annually. The gap in mechanical royalty payouts is an issue that Spotify has previously chalked up to bad record keeping and identifying songwriter credit data and collecting the two songs in their database. So what they're saying is, if you wrote the song, you're getting screwed. And most people who write songs like rappers, they don't, they're not equipped enough to follow the money, to find out what's going on with royalties. So they don't know. They figure, I've already got my paper. Nah, I don't think I'll get no more. Do I get some more? I don't know. So, they don't really know. So, their money is going to the record company or to the people who just ain't paying them. Now, this was, uh, you know, Spotify is in a position right now. A lot of people don't know. Apple's getting ready to buy them out. Apple is going to own Spotify at one point. It's a matter of time before they go ahead and acquire them. I can see it coming. 
They're currently at 15 billion right now. Sending confidential documents to the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission with the intent of taking the company public on the New York Stock Exchange in the first quarter of 2018. So we're going to see what happens. Y'all tell me what y'all think about it. I'm out.